Welcome to another edition of Small Talk for You. This morning I wanted to continue with the UI builder in Squeak and I wanted to build a very simple UI. So I'm going to take a push button, I'm going to drop it over here and I'm just going to put it on the UI and I can come over here and give it a name. So let's call this button one, will not be very exciting there. And that's all I'm going to do there. If you scroll down, you have a variety of options here. You can give it geometry in terms of where things are. You have layout options down here. If I go out to the major UI out here, notice I have this. I can put a table layout and move things around. I can put a proportional layout. So I can change things around. Let's just leave it with proportional for now. And I'm going to give this UI a name. Transcript Writer. And I'll leave that like that. And we'll go ahead and save that as it is. We'll just come back here to the push button. We'll go down here to the bottom and change our text to something like send. It'll be more explanatory, I guess. So we're calling it button one and giving it the text to send. And now what I can do up here is hit save. And it wants my initials, so I'll type JR. And then I want to create this. Notice it said transcript writer UI is what it's created. So we'll go ahead and close the designer. And what we're going to do is we're going to open up a browser. And let's find down here at the bottom, we should find somewhere in widgets custom, I think, transcript writer UI. Okay, once you're finished painting, what you need to do after you close the painter window is come over here into the browser and I need to create a new subclass of morph. I can call it whatever I want, but I need to give it an instance variable of UI. And I need a few helper methods in order to do things. So I need an initialize where I go ahead and send self UI setup UI to self and then I have connector code to connect any of the widgets I've got. So if I have buttons I need to hook up on the clicked signal to set up a sending of this message to myself in this case. So I'm physically hooking up the button to some method. So I need of course to have a send method and here I'm just going to drop hello world to the transcript. More importantly I need this UI method. If it's nil, go ahead and hook the UI up to transcript writer UI, which is the thing I painted. So this is hooking up my application model, if you will, the thing I'm using now, to the actual GUI panel, which is going to be painting the GUI for me. So I ha kind of have a separation here. I have my code, which goes in this class, and then the painter handles the other one. And then I need to do this open method, open in window labeled transcript writer. And again, whatever string I want there to open that. And then I'm going to open up the transcript so we can see what happens. And finally, I'm going to do this transcript writer window new open, do it, do it. And we'll press the send button. And if you go down here to the transcript, it worked. So I've gone ahead and built a simple UI and squeak using the GUI builder that comes from the University of Potsdam guys. So it's pretty cool. Until next time. Have fun with whatever small talk you're using.